So brachytherapy is a form of radiation therapy. Um, a brachy from the Greek meaning arm as in short range and therapy. So it involves taking a radioactive source, putting it next to the tumor or within the tumor using short range radiation from uh, the radioactive thing that you've put inside the tumor to treat it from the inside. The beauty of re uh, using radiation treatment from brachytherapy is because it's short range, um, it shouldn't affect much more outside of the tumor and restricting the area of the side effects to around the immediate area of the tumor. The prostate um, is almost unique in that it's something that we can access. Um, we can visualize it with an ultrasound probe in the back passage at the same time and we can put radioactive seeds into the prostate to treat it from the inside um, with the lowest possible amounts of radiation extending out beyond, beyond the prostate gland. So prostate seed LDR brachytherapy involves putting tiny radioactive seeds into the prostate, leaving them there permanently. They give off short range radiation which gives a very high dose throughout the prostate to kill off the prostate cancer, but only small amounts of radiation extend outside of the prostate um, to try and minimize the side effects to the nearby normal uh, structures. Uh, we need to carefully select patients who could be suitable for curative treatment with prostate brachytherapy, um, see them in clinic, assess them, talk to them about what brachytherapy involves so they can make an informed decision um, about whether they want to proceed with this form of treatment. Prostate brachytherapy is a curative treatment for um, prostate cancer, which is as effective as doing a surgery to remove the prostate um, or radiotherapy, which is usually given with hormones um, over many weeks um, to try and cure prostate cancer. The three main curative treatments for localized prostate cancer, surgery, radiotherapy, brachytherapy, are as effective as each other, but they have quite different side effect profiles. So most patients are suitable for at least um, one, if not two or three of those, and then they have a choice to make and they need to meet a surgeon to talk about uh, prostate surgery, an oncologist to talk about radiotherapy, um, and also somebody who specializes in brachytherapy if they are seen in a center that doesn't actually have direct access to brachytherapy. Um, and then at the end of the day, the patient who's suitable for these treatments is the one who makes the decision. So part of my role is to help patients who are suitable for brachytherapy to decide whether that's the treatment for them. So the side effects are to do with where the prostate is and what's ne immediately next to the prostate. So the main area of side effects are the waterworks. So you've got the bladder that sits on top of the prostate, the urethra, which is the urine tube that runs from the bladder through the prostate uh, and out through the penis. Um, and be just behind the prostate is the rectum, the back passage. Um, so the front wall of the back passage is going to receive uh, pretty much the full dose of radiation because usually it's immediately behind the prostate gland. Uh, there, is a, uh, there is an intervention called space OER, which is a gel, uh, biodegradable gel that, that, that I can in, insert into the narrow gap between the back of the prostate and the front of the rectum to push the rectum away to give it much lower doses of radiation to protect in the long term. Um, uh, but that's, a, that's another discussion. So the intention is to cure prostate cancer. Um, it's a one-off treatment, um, but as with all of the treatments for prostate cancer, not every single patient is gonna be cured. And so everybody has to be monitored and that is by having regular PSA measurements. The PSA measurements go up in the future. We may be suspicious that the prostate cancer has persisted or come back. And then we need to establish whether that patient needs salvage treatment. Salvage treatments after failure of prostate brachytherapy can include observation, can include hormone treatment to try and keep um, the cancer under control, um, can involve having a few additional 
brachytherapy, radioactive seeds being put into an area of persistent cancer. Um, and for some patients, they can have salvage, prostatectomy. That's an extremely specialized form of surgery that's not performed in Kent. But um, we do, I do refer one or two patients a year to some specialists um, in London who um, happen to do that particular form of surgery.